I've had to, I guess, be a, a truthful actor and, and act from the heart. That's probably the, the greatest thing that you get to do. A professional actor like myself, uh, highly trained, work to a script, you know, improvisation's not my strong suit, but uh, look, yeah. I can't tell the difference between, you know, when I'm acting and pretending to be his friend and when in fact I am his friend. I think there's, um, there's not much difference between my character on the show and real life. And they're all just acting and they're not really that bad, but he thinks they're terrible and, yeah. It's, it's a very big risk because we're, we, we're trying not to blow off the, the Kelly show. Mr. Steve Kelly, normal man living a normal life, so he thinks. With 5,000 cameras streaming every single move he makes, from the day he was born, from his first steps to his first driving lesson, all broadcasted all around the world, including China, Africa, Spain, Russia, France, New Zealand, Australia, and of course, Turkey. But there are many challenges to face when acting in a show such as this. For a, a professional actor like myself, uh, highly trained, work to a script, you know, for him to not know what's going on, I've got to try and play along with that, and improvisation's not my strong suit, but uh, look, yeah, it makes it hard. At the end of the day, although the world around him has really been constructed, um, his relationship with me has not. It is completely genuine for him, so it is definitely difficult, um, you know, negotiating that fine line of what is real for me and what is not. Um, mm -hmm. So that's probably been the biggest challenge throughout this whole process, yeah. You have to think on your head sometimes, but um, overall we are professionals. We know what we're doing. Um, it's pretty hard, especially um, when you're in the lunchroom and we have to pretend that we're relaxing and talking about kids and stuff and He's actually genuinely talking about people when really it's just like, yeah, they're all just acting and they're not really that bad, but he thinks they're terrible and, yeah, I feel bad for, um, I think he's dating someone, or he thinks he's dating someone, like that must be really hard and talking about that. And Look, I really play the role of confident and friend and one of my, my favourite previous episodes was when I, um, I told him that Sarah Callow, the principal's daughter, was in fact interested in him and had considered him as a, a possible, you know, or a possibility, let's say. And, um, and I planted that idea in his mind that she was, was keen on him. I find it's hard being his girlfriend because there's lots of, um, you know, personal elements there that a normal couple wouldn't have to share with the world that we do. They were just standing next to each other and Sarah was instructed, look, you're not to make a move. The cameras or the director really wants, you know, Steve to make that first move into the relationship. And look, he was quite shy and reserved and it was all very cute. It's, um, it's very difficult pretending that I'm in love with him. I love carrots. But not as much as I love Sarah Keller. <laughs> He's a hard man to love. In the upcoming episodes, um, we'll we'll get we'll get um, Kelly's girlfriend to um, they'll, they'll get married pretty soon in the next few episodes, All right. and um, they'll have kids soon. So yes, it'll be good. Okay. Do, do you have any feelings for Mr. Kelly? Mr. Kelly, um, nah, not at all. Why do you think that? Oh, nah, it was just a general question. Oh, okay, yeah, no, no, not at all. It's just a job. Yeah, I think it's great. Oh, no, yeah, yeah. nice.
continental cover suit. Just look for the sea. It's not just the adult actors you have to deal with, but also the child actors. It was difficult at the start, at the start but I've gotten used to it and it's really fun. Well, I'm from America and I've been here for a, year, a little bit over a year and it was just really good to be chosen just so quickly for an amazing role. <laughs> wow. Well, I'm a um, person from America. Oh, she sounds very good looking. She <laughs> <laughs> <It> sounds good looking. <laughs> Oh. My mother brought me in here like the day I was born and instantly introduced to the cast and everything. Um, it's 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 really good experience and it's not hard at all. Like he's such a great guy and you just you just love hanging around with him. You know, it's good. Yeah, yeah. It's good. Do you find it, like, hard not to look at any of the cameras that are hidden? Like, if you know it's there, do you, like, attempt to give it a little wink or something as you walk past? Like, ever, ever been tempted to look at a camera? Oh, all the time. You know, <laughs> it's just, you know, you just see the... You know where the cameras are. And, of course, they're just like, don't look at the cameras, don't look at the cameras. And just like, come on, gotta look at the camera. Just wink <laughs> at the camera. Student 246. Student 246. Student 246. Stop winking at the cameras. Oi, oi. What's your attitude, boy? Sometimes you just forget that it's a show, you know, and you forget that the cameras are there, and you forget that it's all it's all made up. And you think, you know, this is this is real. Oh wait, there's a camera there. Don't look at it. Don't look at the camera. Yeah. <laughs> it's fantastic. <laughs> Well, there have been times where I believe that uh, he's, he's almost twigged, but you never know. Uh, me as an actor, I'm so professional, I know what I'm doing. Oh, yeah. So what we have here is a rock, which actually isn't a rock, but it's a camera, and it's hidden in a small compartment over here. And um, I'll just give you a little demonstration if we can move to the other camera. Yep. Alright, so... <laughs> Alright. Yeah, and that, that's, that's one of the cameras for you. So I'll just put this back. When I need to spice up the day, I reach for one of mine. Um, I don't have much of a life outside of this. Ah. Yeah, it takes up most of my time. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, it's hard. I think there's, um, there's not much difference between my character on the show and real life. It's pretty much the ah, same. Yeah. Yeah, sure. do you miss family and things? So. Uh, it is hard, yeah, especially when um, when he asks me where I'm from and I just want to get emotional and um, talk about Africa and stuff but I can't because he just thinks that I put on fake tan every day and I have to go along with that. But um, yeah, it is hard. I miss like living in our little huts and I miss the family and going collecting water every day and stuff like that. It's really hard, and all my poor brothers and that, they don't really eat much. They, um, yeah, so they're pretty poor. So I'm working on the show to send money back to them. Well, my brother is one of the extras, um, another one of the extras in the show, so um, I've got him to kind of talk to and lean on and stuff, but I've been missing my other family very much. Do you find it hard working Oh, look, not, uh, not really. He's, uh, he's pretty easy going, and, uh, you know, there are a few things about him that uh, annoy me, but um, but generally, you know, no, no problems. I can get along with him, all right. 
you know, we've really bonded. And to be honest, sometimes I can't tell the difference between, you know, when I'm acting and pretending to be his friend and when, in fact, I am his friend. Yeah. Um, and look, just to show you some of the, you know, the affection he does feel for me as his friend, um, he makes me these signs occasionally. Um, here's one of a baby. It says, um, thank you for getting me lunch today. That was a very sweet one. Um, then there's a few more. Sorry if I've got my back to the camera. Um, this one says, who's awesome? You're awesome. Yeah. And in fact, there's when we were singing together. I think that's when he really started to come out of his shell. Um, Annie and Rowan are the coolest. That was, I think, I don't know, we just had a good discussion one day and he just wanted to acknowledge me. And then this is my personal favourite. I guess I've really coached him in his role as teacher and he was running his first assembly and, um, and he made me this afterwards because I was standing near the kids and I was like, come on Steve, you've got to pray. And, and um, you know, he really appreciates when I help him. Um, so look, that's just, you know, a few things to show you that he, you know, he genuinely does like me. <laughs> why, why, why did you choose to be in the Truman Show, working with Truman? Kelly. Well, it was a tough one. It was either this or Home and Away. And I believe that this would be, uh, would further my career. Um, it's got a global audience, yeah. like Home and Away is just average teenagers. Um, so, honestly, this is uh, more appealing to my genre of, of uh, acting. So, um, yeah, I guess, yeah, I just really, really love the opportunity. I'm very grateful. I actually think people can see a range of my skills, oh. talents. Yeah. So I'm pretty talented. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's really exciting and I'm really enjoying it so far. Put that in the bloopers. Oh, please. I love bloopers. Uh, yeah, we get it. We've well, done so many bloopers. I think I said the F word as well. Beep, 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 beep. It's like, yeah. kids, don't look. Beep, beep, beep. You really start to, you get to know someone and you, you know, I guess. Oh, hang on, let me start again. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I've got to think of something to say. It's very. Yeah, we're going, we're going, we're going, we're going, we're going, we're going. Alright, yeah, we're we're about to get out, we're about to get out, we're about to get out, we're about to get out. Nah, nah, not at all. Why would I do that? I don't know. It's just a job. No feelings. Nothing at all. Do you think, um, do you envisage, um, Mr. Kelly's character and I getting married at any time in the future? Maybe. I mean, that's that's maybe. a big question for me because you know, yeah, 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 it's my body going through all of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that could be, that could be. All right, so what we have here is a rock, but it's um a very special rock. It's um it's actually a camera. After a while, you sort of get used to it. Like when I first came here at the, uh, the age of birth, I, uh, <laughs> age of birth, <laughs> the age of birth. Sorry, can I try that again? <laughs> Look, I've definitely enjoyed. Okay, now I'll ask you a question. <laughs> That's part one. That was really good. <laughs> that was really good. Um, okay. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> you have to pause it. 
we fended off with 500 kids. And so. Kick off. Kick off. Wait, wait, straight face. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you can't keep a straight face. I can't face. leave a straight face. <laughs> okay. Anyway. Okay. Uh, sort of like a. Um, They raise their hand and they wave. No, no, when they raise, like a. Uh... Yes. You know when you know when they swear. You know, they they do the hand thing and they swear. What's oh, it called? That, oh, that, <laughs> the oath. Oath. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs>